All right, guys, uh, we're going to watch uh, a video about payment for order flow. Um, you're going to learn why all of your beliefs about auction market theory, about supply and demand, why they're all terribly incorrect. Um, so this is a, a clip from the an interview with the chairman of the SEC. Um, you're going to learn about payment for order flow, and you're going to hear him use the words efficiency in the market. So let's have a watch issue that came to the forefront during the meme stock uh, craze a year ago January the question became is it a conflict of interest on the one hand I do get that there are people who look at this situation and say well wait a minute brokers are getting you know are, are giving are getting paid by market makers just so that individual investors can have free commission trades you know on the one hand it is helpful to the market but it's an answer to ban payment for order flow gary or simply solidify disclosures so that people investors can make their own decision about whether they want to pay a commission and not deal with the market maker so uh, we're looking at, at the sec as to how to uh facilitate and drive greater efficiency in this market so investors get a better deal Payment for order flow, as you mentioned, is a payment between a broker that, that a broker receives for your order flow. And there are inherent conflicts of interest there. We're looking at how we can ensure greater competition. When you place a market order in the U.S., a market order at a retail platform, well over 90% of those trades go straight to the dark market, to a wholesaler that bought that order flow rather than competing trade by trade. And that's what we're trying to think through under the authorities we have. Sounds like there are a lot of uh, open open doors that we need to get inside and look more deeply into. Uh, Chairman Garrett Gensler, thank you very much for joining us. We appreciate it. Please come back. Thank you so much. Okay, guys, so we're going to watch just the SEC chairman's bit of that, and I'm going to watch it again, and I'm going to tell you what he means. How to uh, facilitate and drive greater efficiency in How we facilitate and drive greater efficiency in the market. What does ICT talk about? Efficiency in the market. So investors get a better deal. So investors get a better deal, a more efficient market. Deal. Payment for order flow, as you mentioned, is a payment between a broker that, that a broker receives for your order flow, and there are inherent conflicts. There are inherent conflicts of risk, uh, con conflicts of interest between the broker and the market maker and you. Conflicts of interest there. We're looking at how we can ensure greater competition when you place a market order. When you place a market order in the U.S. A market in the United order States, a retail platform. A market order. When you place a market order in the United States on a retail brokerage. For well over nine. Well over 90%. 90 percent of those trades go. Of those trades. Go straight to the dark market. Go straight to the dark market. Okay, to a wholesaler. To a wholesaler. Who bought that order who flow. Who bought that order flow. Rather than competing. Rather than competing. And that's what we're trying to. You get it now? Do you get why ICT works? Do you get why the market is not what you think it is? No, your buy order has no effect on the market. No, your sell order has no effect on the market. Do you get it now? Do you get why what ICT is saying is true? Okay, there's your freaking evidence. It's from the SEC chairman himself. We are looking for a more efficient market. 90% of your orders are routed to wholesalers, and they are not placed against one another. So when are you going to get it through your damn heads that no, the market is not driven by supply and demand. No, your order, auction market theory is bullcrap because that's not how the market works. Let's watch it again. This is from the head of the SEC. Receives for your order flow, and there are inherent conflicts of interest there. We're looking at how we can ensure greater competition. When you place a market order in the U.S., a market order at a retail platform, well over 90% of those trades go straight to the dark market. So a wholesaler that bought that order flow rather than competing trade by your orders do not compete against one another that is from the horse's mouth by trade and that's what we're trying to okay do you get it now guys do you get it do you do you, do you get why what ict is saying is true it's called payment for order flow you get it all right guys in this ict basics video we went over from the horse's mouth payment for order flow and why everything you thought about the market is not true um that's from the horse's mouth, folks. So I hope you get it now. Uh, anyways, guys, in this video, we covered payment for order flow.